Okay, so let's first of all just look at the, if you need a, a few hints on these questions, let's look at the key factors which um, apply for each example. So a, a, cut brown, a cut apple browns more slowly in a refrigerator. What's different about a refrigerator? I think it's fairly obvious that we're talking about temperature there. So you're going to be giving an explanation about why lower temperature is going to slow down the rate of reaction. For B, now what happens in a deep in the ocean which is going to slow down the rate of reaction? Well, it could be temperature to some effect, but the temperature deep in the ocean is not actually a huge amount lower than it is up high. What it actually is, is um, concentration of oxygen. That has the effect there. Now see, a powdered sherbet whiz fizz does not react until it is moistened in the mouth. So what we've got with the um, whiz fizz reaction is it's an acid carbonate reaction. So it's basically baking soda plus, is it citric acid, tartaric acid? I can't think of the formula off the top of my head. And that reacts, of course, acid plus carbonate, salt plus carbon dioxide plus water. And the carbon dioxide, of course, is what makes it fizz. Now, what do we need for this reaction to happen, of course? These need to be aqueous. Why do these need to be aqueous? What has to happen in order for a reaction to occur? Collisions have to occur. And where's fizz? reacts much more rapidly than an alpha-seltzer tablet. Well, we're talking about powder versus tablet, so that's going to be particle size. So see if you can come up with written answers to those in your own words before having a look at my solutions. Which we will have a look at now.